guys, uh, Outer Line Films here, and today I'm going to show you how to uh, make a banner with Macromedia Fireworks 2004. First, what you want to do is uh, go to the thing, and then go to File, go to New, then uh, on that loads, you want to go, you want to probably, well, for me, I'm going to make it 500 and uh, 200 and uh, I got it a custom color which is black you can have it white but I don't I really don't encourage having transparent but then you click OK and then how big it is is this once you get that right there of course it won't make it won't fit my YouTube banner but and then since you got that you want to go to vector make sure it's the rectangle tile on tile up make sure it's the rectangle tool and then what you want to do is you want to cover all the black area real good like that and uh, then it turns it white now I like this background over here on, under assets I think it's that one looks good, the grid, and uh, as soon as it loads, alright, now, what I want to do, I'm going to click the A right here, which is text, I'm going to put, what something I could put, alright, outer line films, outer line Alright, when I got outer line typed in, um, I think, yeah, there we go. You can add pictures or anything to this, but I'm not going to add a picture, unfortunately, because it would take way too much time to add it to make it blend in with the background, and, um, this video can only be a certain amount of time, so when I do that, uh, I want to go ahead and put this, place it right there. And I want to leave it white, but I want to put like a line color right here next to the pencil. And I prefer to use black with white because it makes it look like that and it looks better. Or you can also, on films, I'm going to uh, use a, uh, I want to use a light red. Um, then I want to use also use black for the outline and, um, so it should turn out it should turn out looking pretty good the banner also should so I'm not sure what's going to turn out looking like and then you just want to go like I want to use this light red and then I can do the same thing go to line outer line and uh, make it black and it also looks cool and to make it look blood red, you can go to the effects down here, click the plus, go to shadow, go to inner shadow, and um, it should make it black, yeah, it looks good right there. And if you want, you can put a picture right here, which I'm not going to, like I said, but if you do that and it has a white background on it, click this, the under bitmap click the magic wand tool and you click it click the background of the picture and uh, then erase it uh, so that right there people or wait one more thing let me get out of this magic wand tool or for this I could do this it's gonna I think it's gonna look pretty good after I do this no, it's not. It's too small. <laughs> Let's go ahead and make it bigger so it looks like. I doubt if it will. And it don't look too good. And I don't look good at all. I just don't. But we could do this and go to glow. And it can show up. under eye. It's also, you can also do eye candy, make it polka dots, but not doubt you don't want to do that. But 
Yeah, guys, that's how you use Macromedia Fireworks to do banners and uh, stuff. So we're just going to go ahead and say thank you guys for watching. And uh, we hope we see you guys in another one of our videos. Well, we don't hope we see y'all, but hope you watch our videos. Thanks, you guys.